Every country has its black bag. Every person has their black bag. So the question is, are you going to open it up? Because in there, the, the tradition says that in there, in that place, is your only possibility uh, for following your destiny. Because it's in there that the missing side of the coin is. You know, in the fairy stories, at the beginning of the fairy story, there's a coin broken in two, and they fit together. And the resolution of the story is when the two people come with the two coins and fit it together. In this case, it's the dark side, the dark coin and the light coin coming together and fitting exquisitely. And that somehow a lack of self-compassion has to do with the inability um, to come to terms with this side that we've disowned. We say, I do not own it, I disown it. That is not me. I did not say that to that person at that time. It's something that just came over me. It's almost as if uh, we'll only go out of the house when the moon is growing larger. In the first half of the month, you say, I'm not, I'll come out until the 15th of the month when the moon's growing larger, but I won't come out after that because the moon gets smaller after that. And I certainly will not come out for the three nights of the month when there's no moon at all. Now, if someone did, said this to you, you'd think this was very, very strange. But this is exactly what we say every day with our own psyches, we say. Um, I will only um, like that part of me that can win. I will only like that part of me that can be successful. I will only have affection for the part of me that can say the right thing at the right time all the time. And there's no confidence in the fading moon part of the cycle inside. There's a poem about that. It's called Faith. This image of the moon appeared in the poem. I want to write about faith. I want to write about faith. About the way the moon rises over cold snow night after night. I want to write about faith. About the way the moon rises over cold snow night after night. Faithful, even in its fading from fullness, slowly becoming that last curving and impossible sliver of light before the final darkness. But I have no faith myself. I do not give it the smallest entry. Let this then, my small poem, like a new moon, slender and barely open, be the first prayer that opens me to faith. I want to write about faith about the way the moon rises over cold snow night after night, faithful even in its fading from fullness, faithful even in its fading from fullness. What if the moon suddenly decided it wasn't going to come up the last half of the month because there was only a little bit of it showing? Hey, I'm not coming out until the sun shines on me fully. What is this? I'm going to go slow for the last of the month. It's ridiculous very beauty of the moon is it's coming and going. Yet we have no patience for our own coming and going. You do not have to be good. You do not have to walk on your knees for a hundred miles through the desert repenting do not have to be good. You do not have to walk on your knees for a hundred miles through the desert repenting. You only, only, you only, you only, you only, you only, you only, 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 you only have to let the soft animal of your body love what it loves. 